my channel, I have a interesting review again. Uh, it's from a company called Iris Beauty and it's color contact lenses. I'm scared. So they sent me color contact lenses. They sent me magnetic eyelashes. They sent me eyebrow pencil and eyeliner, liquid eyeliner. So they emailed me and said, hey, check our website out. If you'd like some stuff, pick it out and we'll send it to you. And they did just that. So I have never in my life tried to wear contact lenses. When I received this in the mail, I figured that I would try it out before filming this video. Um, and it was a nightmare. <laughs> So I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't know. I just kept being confused about maybe they were inside out. Like, cause you know, because they're like a little concave, what's the word? They're like a half sphere. And I'm like, what if it turned inside out? Like, how would I know? And it felt like basically there was a grain of sand between my eyeball and the lens. And I literally looked like I had been crying for eight weeks <laughs> because it was crazy. So. Um, I ordered, so there's lots of different colors on their website. So I chose, it's from their Essentials? No, Intense Collection. And it's called Lagoon Blue. And I know I have blue eyes, but these are like a really aqua blue green color. And my eyes are kind of more, I don't know how to describe them. More like gray blue, but it de depends on what I'm wearing and like the light around me, but these look crazy. I don't even think you guys are ready. Um, they have everything, of course, from brown to blue to green. I think they've got, I don't know if they actually have violet lenses because I probably would have ordered those. Um, so purple eyes would be intense and pretty cool. Um, but then they have like gray and just lots of really neat choices. But I have to say, once I got these in, and uh, I got them in properly, they were very comfortable. And I was like, okay, I could see how people can wear these all day and not get irritated. They are FDA approved. They are also ophthalmologist approved. Ophthalmologist, ophthalmologist. Um, and they are made in the United States. So, just so you know. So I will have you all know that I right now am wearing the magnetic lashes. So I am not a fake eyelash type gal. Like I know a lot of YouTubers wear fake lashes. They get all glammed up. My sister is really good at them. Uh, however, I suck. So when I got these magnetic lashes, I was like, yes, because the glue doesn't get everywhere. And then you're not like making irreversible mistakes with your makeup and uh, they feel weird. But anyway, basically they're like little end clip-on thingies that just basically, let me just show you. Ah! So it comes like this. It's just a short little end piece, as you can see. So here, it just has a little tiny magnet on there. And uh, all I do is basically put it on the top lash like that, like set it down, and then take the bottom one, put it right, up to my lash and it just clips basically it, like, it basically sandwiches your natural lashes in between the magnets so it just clips on and I'm gonna go check out my eyelash eyelashes and wash my hands and come back and put in the contact lenses I'm gonna do it on camera um, just because I feel like it'd be more interesting of a video if I did it that way so I'll be right back And also I have to mention that uh, my eyeliner as well as my eyebrows were done with these Iris Beauty pencils. Um, the eyebrow pencil is in brown. Uh, <laughs> it looks like light brown. It doesn't have a name for the actual color, but that's what the dot looks like. So there's that. And then uh, black liquid eyeliner. I think they've got three different colors. I think they have brown, blue, and black. So I tried to fix this eyelash as best I could. So if, if it's off and it's bothering you guys, I apologize, but we're just gonna have to stick it out here. See my badminton blister? I forgot my racket the other night and I had to use a rental racket and the rental rackets are crap. 
and it gave me a blister. So when you get your lenses, they each come inside this special little container. And those of you that wear contact lenses, I'm not sure exactly how similar your lenses come. Um, you should also note that these lenses are also available in prescription. So if you need prescription lenses, check out Iris Beauty. All right, so I'm gonna show you what they look like if I can without spilling the juice everywhere. So can you see this? So there's the lens, you could clearly see the color and it's like, I don't know how to describe it. Yeah, it's definitely um, more intense and green than my natural lashes. Lashes. <laughs> than my natural irises. All right, so I am going to put my hair back so that if a breeze picks up around here, it won't interfere with my lens application. So I hope that this goes better than it did the first time because um, it was kind of a disaster the first time. So I'm just gonna take it out. I did just wash my hands thoroughly. So here, it's like a little birdie on my finger. <laughs> and I'm just going to try to do this in the viewfinder. Okay, so the problem I always have is the lens flexes um, over the curvature of my actual finger, so it like literally inverts itself. No! Come on! No! Okay, you guys, I'm gonna do this off camera, in the mirror, and I'll be back. All right, guys, I'm back, and I had to turn the lights down. <laughs> Let me see if I can turn the mag up. Oh, it, they do something with the contact lenses. So I had a hell of a time getting these in like last time. I don't know, you think I'd learn from the first time? Uh, anyway, so here they are. You can see them. So clearly they're a lot more green uh, than my natural eye color. I really like them. I think that they, once they're in and they're, you know, you're ready to go, <laughs> I could see how they'd be comfortable enough to wear you know, all day long. They actually don't recommend wearing them every day of the week. So um, a couple things. So when I put them in, of course it takes a minute for your eyes to adjust. Um, but I did notice that one of them was moving when I was blinking and I think it's because that one was inside out, if you know what I mean. So the lenses are meant to go one way and not both ways. Even though they, maybe you could get away with wearing it the wrong way, um, but basically, you know, you have to make sure that you have them in right because every time you blink, they move around. So that's kind of how I knew that one was in the right way and one was in the wrong way. And the one that was in the wrong way, I was like, damn, I gotta do it all over again. In fact, once I got this one in, the other one was a breeze because I realized what I was doing wrong. Like, anyway, <laughs> it doesn't mean it won't be hard next time too. But um, also, uh, apparently, uh, these really amplify the light. It's almost like they work as a magnifying glass. So, cause when I came to sit back down and continue filming, I, I almost like, I felt like I was staring at the sun. So this might cause a bit more light sensitivity than normal. So these retail for $49, which is a steal. And they've got dozens of different colors to choose from. And you could have a lot of fun switching up your eye color. I will in a second take one out so you can compare one to the other um, and kind of see the difference. But uh, I went with like this nice lagoon blue. I kind of, I picked out a few different ones. This is the one that they sent me. I did want to try like a brown and then almost like a gray. Uh, so, and I think they just came out with a bunch of new ones too. So, cause I was just on their website looking at uh, some information and I saw that there was a whole bunch of new ones. The magnetic lashes that I'm wearing right now are super handy dandy. I highly recommend them. This one might look a little funky, but uh, that's my fault. <laughs> and the lashes retail for $29. And the eyeliner and the eyebrow brush retail for $12 each. So 
The eyebrow brush is something that I've been using for every day for a week and I really, really like it. Uh, the eyeliner I don't really wear often. So like I, I put eyeliner in when I film and I put eyeliner on like when I'm going out. So it's not like an everyday thing for me. This is the first time I've tried it really like it so far so it just depends on how it washes and uh, all that good stuff so i'm having like post nasal drip from all of this like eye watering happening i'm gonna take one out so you guys can see the difference so here they are and i find that when i blink they don't move around so i thought i think if you're having issues with your contact lenses moving especially if you're wearing color contact lenses um you might have them on inside out, but just say, okay, here we go. Okay. That was successful <laughs> without a mirror. So do you prefer one over the other? Anywho, that's that really like them. And I'm going to be ordering uh, a bunch more, I think just for fun. Halloween's right around the corner and I've got six different costumes coming. I'm going to do a major Halloween costume try on haul, which is going to be so much fun. I cannot wait. Uh, let me know your thoughts. What do you think about these contact lenses? Have you ever tried contact lenses? I should say color contacts. Um, and I don't know. I think it's just a fun way to switch up your look, kind of like chucking on a wig. You know, you can change your eye color from time to time, change one eye if you want. <laughs> One brown eye, one blue eye. Um, anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you. Huge thanks to Iris Beauty for sending me that. Check out their website, www.irisbeauty.com. They've got a ton of different options for colors, eyeliner, eyebrow pencils. Oh, and lashes, magnetic lashes. So check out their website. Um, make sure you're following me on Instagram. I'm at cat.wonders. Uh, follow me on Patreon if you want access to exclusive stuff and little naughty treats. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, but yeah, if you want some cheekier content, uh, I post there almost every day and talk to my patrons directly. So head on over to www.patreon.com slash catwonders and maybe become one of my little wonder cats. And give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Do you, it. do you wear contact lenses? Have you ever tried contact lenses? Colored contact lenses. And uh, what do you think? So you guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you all next time. Bye.